Okay, this is another, uh, this probably won't be that long, probably be a couple of minutes. Um, this upload will be talking about the whole, um, I don't know, support of like, everything has to be multiplayer. I've been noticing that myself. Um, they try to have so many games now that a multiplayer does this game has to have multiplayer because you know it's funner with friends and all of this garbage that they try to say to you know they, they, they have to say this stuff to promote these games so that they get their money back from the money that they've invested and spent into making this game uh, and a lot of people don't they don't they fail to realize that like just because a company says a game is good doesn't necessarily mean it's freaking good it might be terrible as all hell but you won't know that because they're showing you all the good stuff they're showing you all the good things that get you pumped up get you excited same thing they did with the freaking aliens game and that turned out to be a collab of shit every it, 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 i mean <sighs> dude everything does not have to have multiplayer to be a good game they don't they've gotten to the point to where now they're so focused on multiplayer modes they're so focused on having everything but multiplayer to the point to where they don't even pay that much attention to a single player mode anymore i guess they think that we all just love each other to the point to where you can just get online and a bunch of people are going to be like, oh, this person is new. Heck yeah, invite them to the, uh, invite them to our party, you know, let them join our crew or clan or guilt or whatever the hell they're calling each other online this damn time. You know, you know, invite them over here. Yeah, you know, uh, uh, we're all buddies around here. Get the hell out of here. <sighs> let me tell you something. If you're looking for friends online, good freaking luck. Because it's a rare event that occurs. It is extremely rare. You can send. Let me tell you something. I've tried it myself. When Xbox first launched that crap, the online, uh, the Xbox Live thing. I tried to do the multiplayer games, and you try to send messages to people, a friend message. Like, do you, you have to realize when you get online, you're playing with assholes. You just are. You're playing with a bunch of damn assholes. They're probably either just some cocky ass person that needs to prove that they're better than somebody to boost up their little stuff of seem uh stuff of, uh self confidence, self esteem issues, or self worth issues that they may have. And cause I mean, think about it. A multiplayer and I've watched online matches multiplayer makes me sick it just makes me damn sick and almost every single multiplayer game discusses the hell out of me and the reason that is is because they you have multiplayer multiplayer would be good but it's the people on on the multiplayer like when it's one of those free open world multiplayers see that's where all the stupidity comes in because you got folks especially on fighting games this is why I can't get into online fighting games I just can't I don't understand why a number of people even still attempt to play them you have uh, matches that they set you up with with somebody that knows way more about this game than you do so this pretty much prevents any newcomer coming into this game this pretty much whether they know it or not they pretty much destroy them their selves when they when they make multiplayer games like this if you're going to uh, have matchmaking in your game have it match up uh, a person with a, a low experience level with someone else that has a low experience level do not match up someone that has a level 3 and you match them up with somebody that has a level damn 20 that's just that's stupid as shit like even 
and, and I know what you're thinking like well what if that person that's at a level 3 already has you know experience in playing this game well that's a roll of the dice you know I mean that's that's really a roll of the dice because it might not turn out that way all the time but then you have your first person shooters where you know you got some asshole running around constantly stabbing folks or they got what well, they got what they got one now where I guess you can shoot the knife which is the stupidest shit I've ever seen in my life you can shoot the knife like you would a gun so you don't even have to get up close to him anymore you can just shoot him with the, the the blade of the knife and it kills him instantly it's like an instant kill um what else um Let's see, uh, you got the fighting games with multiplayer, you got the shooting games with multiplayer. Oh my gosh, yes. Rage quit. That's another thing that pisses me off. I've experienced it more than once. This is why I just refuse to even play multiplayer games anymore. The rage quitting. Like, if you can't stand, you can stand winning, but you can't stand getting beat. Just don't fucking play multiplayer at all. It's so freaking stupid to me. I, I hate when people do this crap. They make me so damn tired. All while they're whooping my ass, they're playing the game. But when the table start to turn, all of a sudden you just out of, out of the blue, you disconnect. That is so freaking stupid to me. Like, why did you even get on the damn game to begin with? This, this is why I, I, I hate multiplayer. Another thing I can't stand with the whole headset thing on multiplayer. That's annoying as fuck to me. It really is. You got. Let me tell you something. I've been called. I've been called shit that I can't even be offended by. You know. I, like sometimes it, it's like a big question mark would come up on my head. I'd be like did they really just call me that shit? I've done been called. Uh, I, I've done been the N word. I've done been called a fucking Jew, and I'm not even fucking Jewish. I've been called a fucking Jew. Uh, um, what else? One dude. Uh, I've been called a faggot like thousands of times to the point to where that's somebody else might take offense to that. That's just fucking humorous to me. Like, I've never been with a dude in my entire damn life, so if I don't know, maybe this is their way of coming out the closet is to call me a faggot so they can feel more comfortable being one. I don't know. But like I have been I've even got mistaken one time, no bullshit. You remember when Mass Effect 3 came out with the multiplayer? I was actually playing online as a female shepherd. Instantly like these fuckers would not fucking help me out in in the in the Mass Effect three games. You're supposed to play as a team. These cunts refused to play as a team because I decided to come into the team as a female shepherd. The other the other assholes that I was playing playing with were all damn male ships. These fuckers was running around healing each other but when I went down they just ran fucking past me and I'm like really nobody's gonna nobody's gonna fucking help me out huh I got the strongest fucking weapon in the damn game because I've, I played the game more by myself and I'm outranking these I'm outranking I'm outranking the other damn three idiots that I'm playing as that's what's fucking stupid. You would think to yourself, if you're going to heal anybody in your team, you're going to heal the strongest damn person you have, right? That would be the smart... Nope. Not, not according to these damn idiots. And these fuckers didn't even know what was so funny. Is that all of them, all of these assholes remain completely fucking quiet. After I had exposed that they thought that I was a female because I had chose to play a, a female shepherd. When I exposed myself as a dude, all of the fucking trash talking stopped. I don't know. It, 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 it kind of made me chuckle. 
But all of the fucking trash talking, all of the name calling and shit, cunt this, cunt that, all that shit fucking stopped when they found out that it was a fucking guy behind the microphone. Shit just makes me, I don't, I just don't really fuck with online gaming. If PC, that's fine, but like, with the console, man. Shit doesn't even amaze me no more. I'm, I'm more into single player modes, versus modes. You know what I'm saying? If you if you do got multi, I'm not saying that multiplayer is like useless. But when you, if you don't got any buddies online that you can get in contact with, uh, I don't know, you you take a chance on multiplayer. Like, like I said before, it, it's a roll of the dice. You know, is it necessary? Mm, to a certain extent but the way that folks are hyping it all up and you know every game every game has to have online multiplayer no the hell it does not I've seen tons of games that are focused around single player and versus versus modes and they are doing just fine without the multiplayer so I don't know if, if you into the multiplayer thing Maybe you got a group of friends that you can play head to head online or play play in uh cooperative modes with but if you're a person that's just coming in to playing games online go in with a grain of salt. Like you might have an awesome ass experience and then again you might have a terrible ass experience, but don't go in looking for anything too awesome because I don't know. It's just, like I said, it's a roll of the dice.